How you doing guys and welcome to another quick video. Nothing fancy here, I'm just gonna show you how to control your Android device, whether it's an Android TV, um, an Nvidia Shield or some sort of Android TV box and you are gonna be able to control that with your Amazon Echo or Echo Dot or whatever. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is go to the Amazon Skill Store on the Amazon app and download the uh, Alberto Sonoris app. Just install that and it tells you everything about what it can do here turn on video, Netflix, whatever, etc., etc. So you can read up about that and see what else you can do. After you've installed the skill, go to the um, the uh, Google Play Store on whichever Google device you have and install the companion app on that device, okay? So that would allow you, that would allow you, to, get, allow you to get the two devices talking. So I have mine installed on my Android TV, which you've probably seen in a previous video. And as you can see in the bottom there, Alberto Sonoris. Open the application. These are the apps which I've chosen already. And if you want to add your own app, just go down to the plus uh, icon there, hit that one, and then you can choose your apps from there. Once you've chosen the app you want, it will appear on the screen and you are done. From there, we need to go back to our Amazon Echo app and then we will go to the three dots at the corner. Then we need to go to Smart Home and then Add Device. So when you add device, it's gonna do the searching, you know, the normal searching as if it was a, a, a physical device. And then from here, you can see things like, um, there's the London Transport Status app I, I uh, installed. There's the uh, Netflix one here. Uh, there's Terrarium. Their show box, so they would. Just, so once you've installed them, as I showed you on the on the actual app on the Android device, and then you do a uh, search, it will pick them up in here as a device. Okay. Then once you've done that, I found the best way is to open a routine, and then fit say things, and then type um, create a routine. Mine just says uh, Netflix, and another one says YouTube. So when I say those words, Alexa, Netflix. Okay. Alexa, YouTube. Okay. So you can open anything you want um, just by using your voice. Alexa, terrarium. Okay. So as you can see, you can control the, your devices. Now, the app developer says that you can use um, voices like play, pause, etc. But as you've probably seen in another one of my videos, I used a broad beam, a broad link black beam. Now for under 10 pounds, this is probably the best thing you can get because it can control any device using RF as, as if it was your remote. So it's easy to program and then create um, uh, extra commands. I'm not gonna use the app for that. I'm just gonna use um, my broad link because I, I really like what it can do. So if I say something like Alexa, Netflix, Okay. So that's using the app which I just showed you, the Alberto Sonoris. But now I need to um, go into Netflix. So I can say, Alexa, select. Okay. And then the broad link is, uh, I programmed the key for select and the broad link has taken over. So if I want to watch this now, I can say, Alexa, select. So now I can just start the program from there. Alexa, pause TV. Okay. It's very easy to set up. I've gone with the broad link for the extra controls, but if you just want to launch applications, etc., um, go ahead and, and get the Alberto Sonoris uh, applications and skills, and I think you're really going to enjoy it. All right, thanks, guys. Cheers. Take care, and see you later.